Florida's West Coast, long known for beautiful beaches and clear water, has also gained a reputation for something unpleasant, red tide. This nearly annual event is caused by the rapid and uncontrolled growth of the algae Karenia brevis, which produces toxins that are harmful to people and animals. In large algal blooms, these toxins can lead to widespread fish kills, marine mammal illnesses or death, and respiratory irritation in humans. And the impacts from red tide don't stop there. With blooms lasting anywhere from a few months to over a year, related beach and fishery closures, reductions in tourism, and cleanup efforts can cost local economies millions of dollars per outbreak. As red tide continues to occur year after year, so too do its devastating impacts, highlighting the urgent need for solutions to limit the negative outcomes of Karenia brevis. In response, Scientists have been developing innovative strategies to tackle the problem and protect our coastal communities and ecosystems from harmful algal blooms. One of these strategies is biological control, which harnesses the power of naturally occurring bacteria to target and eliminate harmful algal bloom cells and their toxins. One such biological control, currently in the research and development phase, uses a naturally occurring bacteria that produces an algicide that kills Karenia brevis and other toxic algae. Researchers have developed a way to encapsulate this bacteria and its algicide in affordable, biodegradable, gel-like beads that can be produced in large quantities. The project team calls this new algal control system DinoShield because it targets and disrupts the growth of harmful algae known as dinoflagellates, which includes Karenia brevis and shields the ecosystem from their impacts when deployed at targeted locations. Once Dino Shield beads are ready, they're placed in specially designed bags that can be deployed in areas prone to the impacts of red tide, such as aquaculture reefs, marinas, and waterfronts. And if you're wondering if Dino Shield is safe for the environment, the answer is yes. Both lab and field studies have shown that DinoShield targets and eliminates Karenia brevis without harming the surrounding ecosystem. Our coastlines stay healthy and marine life are given a better chance to thrive. While multiple strategies are ultimately needed to combat harmful algal blooms, DinoShield is proving to be a promising part of the solution. Following federal approval and local permitting, strategic deployment of DinoShield can limit red tide and its impacts and help protect beautiful beaches, coastal resources, and local economies. <laughs>